it's been like five months since my last video, but to be fair, never said that I was gonna try to make weekly videos. Originally, I wanted to roll out one video per week. That was the goal. So why would I publish my most successful video and then just drop off? You're probably thinking, wow, you really think 169 views is success? Mm, that answer is, yeah, I kind of do. Because that means like humans actually sat down and watched the content that I was putting out there. That's a big deal. And honestly, I hope to always be as thankful for every single viewer, even when we hit big. But for real, why, why did I stop? Well, like most of you, life just gets busy. Work, school, I'm trying to get a little bit healthier. So outside of my family, my job is my primary responsibility. So I try to draw a pretty hard line between my current profession and content creation. But you all have the privilege of seeing me in a much more casual, silly light. I also made this crazy decision to try to go back to school for my bachelor's in business management. And this is taking me far too long. Uh, I get to certain classes uh, that I don't like and I'm just like, Ugh. I know I, if I would just buckle down and get through it, it would be over. And I, I would have more time to focus and dive into this YouTube thing. But I also made this crazy goal to finish that before I did dive into this YouTube thing. It's just taking too long. I, I, uh, But I am so close to completing that. Once that's finished, you all will see a lot more of me on here. Also, back in June of this year, I wanted to be more active and a little bit healthier. Uh, so what's the bare minimum I can do? Mm, 30 minutes a day of walking. So I started walking 30 minutes a day uh, and a huge motivation was just closing the exercise ring. Then in July, that walk, turned into a run. Just walking the same path gets kind of boring. I wanted to speed it up a little bit. So I downloaded the Couch to 5K app and started running. And that first five minute run, I I'm surprised that I even survived it. I'm fairly certain it causes lots of fatalities per year. August rolls around uh, and I get two of the cutest running buddies. Well, sometimes. It they gotta see how they feel. September, I completed my first 5K. Signed up for a second one. What better way to celebrate Batman Day 2022 than to run a Batman Run Series virtual 5K? Now, by some miracle, I'm able to run 3.1 miles. So what's next? Let me go for a 10K. I could do that, it's just double, right? No, no, I'm a little bit crazier than that. So I'm going to just go straight up marathon training and go for it, 26.2 miles. Insane thought process. But I start, and then I do four miles, six miles, eight miles. Then COVID came for me, pushed me down. I went from eight mile, no, not the 2002 film starring Eminem, but maybe somewhere in the ballpark of that determination. Went running from eight miles to not even be able to take eight steps without being winded. Sitting back wondering how would I have even caught this? I don't go out in public very often. I was social distancing before it was like even a known thing. No touching, no touching, no touching. No touching. No touching. Turns out my family in the public all the time and they just serve as little illness delivery couriers like I have a package for you. But my lovely bride just weeks away from finishing nursing school. So she is professionally trained to take care of sick people. So I'm in the clear, right? Nope. Turns out she works in intensive care units, so she knows what sickness actually looks like. Me being a wuss did not qualify. Uh, day one, granted we didn't know I had COVID at this time, but day one, I decide, you know what? If I can get outside, get some fresh air, I'll feel better. Then halfway through realize I've made a huge mistake. I made a huge tiny mistake. So I drag myself back to the house, go upstairs to crash, to find the bed uninhabitable. Sheets have been stripped, there's no covers, and I just need to fall. So I go to the nearest cushion surface of the house, which is our living room couch. The brightest, loudest room. 
is how I'm gonna get through this. A few days go by, I try to get back to exercise and I really don't want it to weigh me down, but my body's like, nah, bruh, we don't do that anymore. We, uh, we take naps now, we don't exercise. Honestly, the brain fog's probably the most embarrassing. I remember like opening the refrigerator and thinking to myself, does this milk go in the refrigerator? Yeah. Uh, does it though? Because I'm pretty sure I tried to put Doritos in here yesterday. So now, let me get a little bit vulnerable with you. Even though I wasn't uploading, I spent a lot of time thinking and planning and dreaming about what this channel can grow into, will grow into. I studied my first five videos and really didn't like my findings. My delivery lacked enthusiasm. So how do I fix that? That like hard line between my professional life and content creation was a little bit more blurred than I thought. Uh, I was just coming across boring. I was a, being a little bit too business and not enough casual for the subject matter. I get that I'm a pretty chill guy, but I don't want to come across as boring. And all the fun seemed to be in the B-roll footage when the A-roll footage was just monotone and kind of lacked enthusiasm. I need that, the A-roll footage, to be captivating and interesting alone without any B-roll footage. Or maybe I just need some signature moves. Uh, you, you know the ones I'm talking about. Let's get started. Hello, Internet. Welcome to Game Theory. Boys, today. Thanks for watching. Catch you guys later. Peace. So discovering how boring those first five videos were may not be the biggest reason I haven't been uploading, but definitely a deciding factor. So what now? What's next? Well, Thanksgiving is my all-time favorite holiday. Our family makes a vacation out of it. Maybe I can do a thankful video, which yeah, will probably still happen. But my daughter made a great point. She said, Dad, you don't want just vacation videos. And she's right, how pretentious would that be? Well, I've really been wanting to do a Let's Play video. Uh, the new Bendy game is, what, days away from releasing? Bendy? Portal RTX is supposed to come out this month. Fairly certain I've already expressed, even on this channel, my love for that series. Even designed some merch based on it. In fact, I wore it in the first video on this channel. I was super excited for Gotham Knights. But then I played it. Listen, I tried. I really tried to get into it. It's just such a missed opportunity. To make Batman ridiculous, I'm okay if he's dead. Of course, you know I'm a huge fan. But okay, he dies. And then you have these four characters that get to shine but you've destroyed all of them. When was Red Hood ever just this meathead? I did jump back into Fortnite this season, but I think that content's either oversaturated or played out. Plus, I'm really not that good. I doubt you'd want to see me play, unless I turn it into a comedy bit. Maybe. Maybe we'll do that. Maybe I'll just let you roast my uh, lack of skill there. I also considered making a would you rather video with my wife. I'm pretty sure her big doe eyes would really captivate viewers the way they captivated me in my heart. Do, do, I get, do I get points for that? Oh yeah, and we have the and versus or video concept that we mentioned in the parent versus gaming video. But do we want to do a bunch of versus videos? Sure, we'll just make a full battle out of it. As I said, I've spent a lot of time thinking and dreaming here, but what's your thoughts? What kind of content would you like to see? The comment section is down there for a reason, as is that like button. So after five months without publishing, I'm back. Well, sort of, not really. I still have that school stuff to finish. <laughs> Hey, thanks for sitting through and listening to me give excuses about why I'm not doing the thing that I'd love to do. But if you are still watching this, just maybe, just maybe this channel does have a chance. Thanks.
because I'm constipated. Can't stop. Can't stop. Can't stop. Can't stop. Can't stop.